I'm Daniel Sanham. I currently study at the University of Nottingham, studying electrical and electronic engineering. Currently in my final year, having just done a placement with Renault F1 and Infinity. Uh, the university provided me with a real sound knowledge of the theory and foundation of electronics, and that was really evident when I went and did my internship. I was able to fit in seamlessly with the teams in terms of I was able to get working straight away on the projects that were assigned to me. So for that, I'm always thankful because without that, you know, the, the solid foundation I was given at university, I wouldn't have been able to compete and actually gain an internship the way I had. Besides the theoretical and practical knowledge the university has provided me, they've also allowed me to develop professionally and personally. For example, my communication skills have improved tenfold because various projects require you to present your findings to various tutors. And in respect with networking, you have to be able to acknowledge and find who can do what within the environment you're working in to get tasks done quickly and efficiently. If I hadn't had this from university, I wouldn't have performed so well in my internship. So last year I was part of the Infinity Engineering Academy, which is a global search across several continents to find the very best in the young talent. And part of this is to work six months with Infinity, the automotive company, and six months with Renault F1, the Formula One team. I was employed as an electronic engineer. Um, both the six month placement with Infinity and Renault was superb opportunities for me. I enjoyed it a lot. They gave me projects that tested me and pushed me to my limits. Uh, it wasn't a case of you know, I was making cups of tea, I wasn't just filing papers, it was real sort of applicable work which was working on the vehicles that they had there. Uh, I had plenty of highlights. Uh, I was up in the Sunderland factory at Nissan because they're producing the Infinity Q30 there. Uh, it was amazing to see the scale of the project there. With Renault F1, I was sent to the Italian Grand Prix and the Canadian Grand Prix uh, to market the Infinity Engineering Academy and to get other students involved. As part of that, I was treated as a VIP in the paddock club uh, for three days uh, over the duration of the race. Uh, Italy and Canada and that for me was, <laughs> it doesn't get much better than that really. <laughs> in terms of the support at the two companies, the engineers there have been there for years and they know their stuff so when they're giving you advice on how to approach tasks, how to assimilate with a team and get involved and get hands on, I mean you can't get much better than that really. Uh, motorsport is cutting edge technology, automotive has to be by the very nature with safety, efficiency, it has to be at the very edge, so working with engineers like that. And the support they actually gave, even though I was just on an internship, I wasn't treated like an intern, I was treated like an engineer who was contributing. As a result of the internship, I've actually signed a contract to go and work with the Renault Formula One team as of July 2017. That wouldn't have been possible without the internship or my degree, so my studies with the University of Nottingham. So prospects look good. It looks like I'm going to be in Formula One for many years to come. And I've got basically the University of Nottingham and the Infinity Engineering Academy to thank for that.